I have nothing to offer but blood, toil, tears, and sweat. Hey folks, Cody at Jagged Road Films again. A2A Simulations is releasing a patch for their new Piper Cub. I wanted to take the time to talk to you guys about some of the new features that are being offered in this new patch. The word patch is kind of funky because it doesn't really define all the work that's been put into this. One of the cool really new features in this patch is the ability to tow the aircraft. As you can see, we just pushed this float plane version of the aircraft off land into the water. But trust me, it doesn't end there. Now you're not going to believe this. I just grabbed that oar and I'm manually paddling the aircraft. Directionally. It's almost like a click and grab interface. Pretty cool, huh? These new features offer a level of freedom never seen before. If I want to land on a lake and pull up to a log cabin, I just simply land and paddle right up onto the shore. I can reverse that if I want to go ahead and take off. With the risk of sounding like a used car salesman, that feature doesn't stop there. All variants of this aircraft now have the ability to be towed and moved around at freedom. All those lonely hangars in Flight Simulator are now parking spots for your Piper Cub. Even the old Tundra Wheel version's got an upgrade that I think some people are going to raise their eyebrows about. Just watch. The advanced piloting technique of using the Tundra Wheels to slow down on water and reduce the landing distance is now possible. I told you it was pretty cool. A2A Simulations has improved an already excellent aircraft by adding new features once again. That's a mighty big thank you, A2A Simulations. Keep on keeping on.